And over here, I'm going to put, um, this is where I'm going to put my okra and eggplant. And then back here, here's my, I've got kale. I've got about three kinds of kale in there. I've got Russian kale. I've got Lacento kale. I've got curly kale. Then down front, I've got some chard Here's my um, lettuce that I grew last year, and it was supposed to be some 45-day lettuce. Well, I planted that on October the 1st of last year. And then there's a broccoli plant. Got a broccoli plant right there that kind of sneaked in there some kind of way. I'm sure I planted that last year also. And then back here in the back, I'm getting those buckets ready to plant some more collard greens. I'm gonna put some more collard greens there. And then over here we have broccoli from this year. And here's some broccoli that I planted last year, October of last year, and it's actually just started sprouting this year. And we've already harvested quite a bit of broccoli and you see it's starting to come back. And then over here we have some spinach. So we're looking at getting a really good crop of spinach there. And then over there, there's my collard greens again. Let's take a look to see how my potatoes are doing. My potatoes still have not, they're just now starting to peek through the ground. So hopefully my potatoes are gonna take off pretty soon here. I got still got some more that need to be planted. And that's gonna be my entire garden. That's my entire garden. 